Before you came to live with us, I was the star. How could I compete with you, with, with someone who could touch the stars? Before you crashed in that pod, I had a great life with two great parents. Someone cut something out of you and you feel the hole every day. A hole you dug in yourself. The man that I loved hasn't been a father to me in years. Since when have you become so hard and cynical? Well, not all of us are bulletproof. So cynicism, that's what's keeping the rest of us alive. Seems like it's killing you. Recognize this? Alex, please wake up. Alex, I know you're in there. This is a you. I had not enough. But his obsession with keeping you safe changed all of it. So how could I do what? Devote my entire life to watching over Kara? Nothing else mattered to him, the least of all me. Do you know what I see when I look at you? An abused child. There's never been room for you. And that's my fault. You feeling like less somehow made me feel like more. But he treated me like I wasn't even worth his time. This is rock bottom. And I know what kind of person I'm going to be. I don't care. You don't care. You can call me Agent Danvers. Let's dance. I know you're in pain. I'm not in pain. Of course you are. Okay, stop telling me how I feel. You are the strongest of us all. Your father always said that. I have spent my entire life protecting this whole family, and I will not do it again. You always make the hard choice. How could you? You look to help others before yourself. How could you? That's what you told me to do. You betrayed our family. Everyone that I love. See the rage? That's your loneliness. You have always been my super. You are always the best part of me. I just got so mad at everyone. But the reality is that I was just mad at myself. To change you. He wanted you to become him. But you are nothing like him. Nothing.